So I just feel this incredible sense of gratitude for this program, for the, the structure of it, for the ways you've gotten us thinking, because it's there's so much beauty and so much power and so much talent and so many different ways to go about working on the on the problems in journalism, but also in how we are people in the world and all our diversities. But now I have like literally new words and dreams and things that I've put out on paper. I have an actual 10-step plan of things that are in my grasp, resources I've realized I already have at my disposal. Um, and while I've been in this space of rethinking, like what a blessing that has been, to know that there are things that I can do, literal people that I can call now, many of them in this room, um, to take my career to, a next, to its next phase. And I was really skeptical at the start. I didn't know that that was gonna come for me. And you have to be very clear, right, about who it is I am, how do I want to show up, what do I want to get out of this meeting, what do I want to say, what do I want to make sure people hear, right? And that's all with intention. I was in a meeting with my editor and I said to him, you know, I've edited this style of breaking news many, many times. I've earned a seat at that table. And I've never really said that to an editor before. And he looked at me and he said, yeah, you're right. You'll, from now on, you'll be at that meeting. And I've been at these meetings ever since. And I think to myself, where did I get that strength to, to say that? And I got it from Gloria, I got it from Farah, I got it from Patricia at Take the Lead, and I'm really grateful for that, so thank you. It makes a difference when we can see women who look just like us at the top. I just want you to know that I thank all of you. And it reminds me that being in this space um, tells you that the world is bigger than where you are right now. So I think for me it's been really reaffirming to see women still dreaming big no matter what stage of their life they're in and knowing that they can always reinvent their lives and reinvent themselves and I think that that's so important and for me that's been reaffirming to know it's normal to still have big dreams so I'm walking away feeling really reaffirmed and feeling like I'm not crazy to dream big and to be and wanting to be ambitious and that's really important to to just keep thinking of new dreams and I did not come to this leadership program um, to find another job um, but I have found another job <laughs> yeah. my story is the story of the women who have given me their shoulders to stand on. And this cohort has given me 49 new shoulders to stand on, which is pretty amazing.